Insulating your pole barn creates a number of advantages, probably way more than you realize. In this video, I'm going to give you insulation tips to help your pole barn perform better and last longer. First, it's important for you to understand just how important insulation is for your pole barn. By helping to maintain a more consistent temperature, insulation will help you generate low energy costs, prevent damage and deterioration that comes from rust, mold, and mildew, and promote an overall healthier environment for both people and animals. Next, you want to remember to plan for insulation in the design phase. A properly designed wall system and overall pole barn structure can improve your building's ability to withstand cold and heat by at least 17% and possibly more. You also want to be strategic about the thickness of your insulation and its R value, which indicates the insulative properties of the material used. The higher the R value, the higher the insulation capacity. Closely related, most insulation comes in three forms, fiberglass, foam, or cellulose, and it's important that you match your insulation material to your needs and budget. Now, insulation for your walls is important, but don't forget about slab or foundation insulation. Opting to add slab insulation down the road is an expensive process and requires digging up your site and trying to squeeze it in under your building. As you're thinking about insulation, you also want to plan for ventilation using vent ridges and eaves. Good ventilation is also going to help you control heat, cold, and moisture and protect what's inside your pole barn. For more details on these tips plus bonus insights on condensation control, check out the link in the comments or description section.